Hello everyone, welcome to Techie Pocket. Today I'm just throwing out another Ryzen 5 build log, or not build log, but a build list. A $1,100 build for the 1600 non-X. Now, of course, it has the 1600. The link from Newegg will be in here. It's using the Cryorig H7 because that is a good CPU for overclocking. Not extreme overclocking, but you can do pretty good overclocking with this. I went with the Asus Prime B350 Plus because it's only $90, and what's great about it is that for only $90, it still includes an M.2 port, which is very rare for a motherboard of this type. Another very good thing about it is its I.O. You can see it has USB 3.1, 4 USB 3.0s, and 2 USB 2.0s. Do note that there's no USB Type-C, and you're losing the 7, the 6 audio ports, I mean. Here we have the G-Skill Aegis, Aegis, I don't know how to say that, but it's the G-Skill 16GB kit 2x8, it's 2800MHz for $107. That is pretty pricey, but you gotta remember that's DDR4 2800, and uh, that's pretty much what you'll need. <laughs> I went with the 250GB M.2 again because it's a good price and it's the 960 EVO. Uh, 960 Pro is a little faster, I think, but for the price, I think this one's pretty good. 2TB WD Black because it's only $123, which is twice as much as the 1TB Blue version, and this is the black version, which means it's going to be a lot faster and twice as much storage for only twice as much of the price. RX480 from ASUS. This one's probably not the best price you can get for an RX480, but for an RGB RX480, everyone knows this is the one to go with. The NZXT S340, it's not the Elite version, but it's black and red, which means it'll fit with all the other parts we chose, and being the S340, that's a very good case, and it's only $65. For this price point, I'd say there basically isn't any better case you can get than the S340, and that's really why I chose it. Then we got a 550 watt 80 plus bronze certified semi-modular power supply from Enermax. $80. Nothing really special. I also included Windows 10 Home because I like to include that in all the prices of my build. Okay, so that's it for this build. $1,100 build. Once again, I recommend you guys research before ordering any of these products for your build, and if you like it, give it a thumbs up on this video. If you don't, give it a thumbs down, and please tell me all your suggestions in the comments below. I even take suggestions for videos that you guys want me to make, and that's all I have to say, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.